my website just got hit by this. Maybe your website got hit by this, or if you have clients, their website just got hit by this. Google has something in their search results called rich snippets. It's those stars. If someone leaves a review and, and you can optionally try to show the review stars in the Google listing. And what happens is it's very eye catching, right? Someone does a search, they see stars, not just words, and it will draw your eyes there and you'll click on it. Well, those are called rich snippets and there are tools for WordPress to add those rich snippets to your website and Google will sometimes pick those up and show them for your website results when someone, when they're suggesting your website. Well, um, all good things come to an end. There've been some changes with rich snippets. My website got hit hard. So if you're wondering where the heck your rich snippets have gone, then maybe this is uh, info that is going to help you. So here's an article that says Google cracks down on some rich snippets uh, reviews, uh, but there's other rich snippets where they've changed the rules with it and tightened it on up. And this is based on information that Google recently put out so uh, essentially um, here's like three rules that Google's being very clear about Google is now showing review rich results only for a clear set of schema types for review snippets non self serving reviews this i've seen you go to a you do a search and it it's the product's website and every page on that website it's showing 67 or some random number of reviews and they're all five stars those are self serving reviews and they're gone already they're gone now okay and uh, reviews that have the name property within the markup. This is where you have to pay attention to this right now. So even if the rich snippet, the schema that you're using on your website for various pieces of content is not going to be affected per se with regards to the self-serving concept and some of the review schema types that are not going to get those stars anymore. You still have to make sure you go in and make sure this property is set upright. I'll be for the first to admit that it's not on my website. So all of the rich snippets uh, for my website have been wiped out. What this means though, is if you have been relying on a reliable provider for that to add schema to your website. So for me, it's WP schema pro or schema pro something like that it's by brainstorm force i'll have to get a link and put that down below so you can see the exact schema tool that i'm using and it's probably a good time to have a brand new video tutorial about schema uh, point being uh, they released an update a few days ago and if you're not using that schema tool and you're using another one you're going to want to make sure that the developer is going to provide an update but that doesn't solve the problem updating it doesn't solve the problem i have to go in there and i have to add the name property and then i have to put information in that name property so i have a little bit of work to do maybe you have a little bit of work to do as well here is a list of the schema types that are going to show uh, rich snippets. So we got books, course, uh, episode events, games, how to, uh, movie, product organization, recipe, and all of that. So each of these schema types have different requirements. Uh, I know this is kind of a techie topic, but it's a very important topic if you were using this and you're noticing your snippets are now gone from Google, now you may know why. Now, sometimes the WordPress theme that you're using, the theme developer is putting those rich snippets in, or the schema that would generate those rich snippets in the theme. Well, you want to make sure that that theme developer is on top of it as well uh, if you're losing your snippets in 
Google. Uh, anyways, uh, if you have clients and they notice their stars are gone and, and they're knocking on your door, now you know why. If you're Googling your own website and they're gone, now you know why. I'll go ahead and work up a new tutorial for Rich Snippets given this information. It's a good time to do that anyway. Um, and I will uh, put that out and add a link in the video description down below. As usual, I want to you to share your opinion in the comment section down below. Remember to thumbs up on this video if you found some value in it. Hey, this was actually pre-recorded in a live stream that I did earlier just a few days ago. If you would like to be notified when I have my next live stream, remember to subscribe and click on that notification bell. They're a lot of fun. I cover the topics and I answer your questions live. Then I slice and dice it and then share those videos out throughout the week. So it's in a more digestible format. I'd love to have you on the next live stream so just subscribe and do that notification bell and YouTube's gonna let you know when I go live thank you for watching this video I really appreciate it and I can't wait to see you in the next one